Yeah, it's always magic when it comes to math. Okay, so got those things done. Yay! Out of stock. That was quick. Let's the man. Welcome back to Learning Factory. I'm the man to the gentleman. Well, we're gonna take another look, a little look at, at the game because, well, I'm gonna be honest with you. This is super early access version of the game, right? The key has been provided by the developer, which I'm very, very grateful for. And yeah, well, you may think that this is another copy of Factorio. I'm guessing that the core gameplay is quite similar, uh, but this game is actually supposed to also teach you a few things, such as like actually analyzing data and machine learning. So uh, if you're looking for a game, like if you are a parent, I don't know what you're doing over here, wasting your goddamn time, man. Take care of your kid. But if you're looking for a game uh, that you can potentially give to a kid, well, I am guessing this is going to be a good try. To my understanding, this game is actually supposed to not be violent. I don't know. I mean, I can turn everything into violence, even a fucking bucket. So, yeah, we'll see how about that thing. So last time we started to do some basic, let's say, factory layout. Uh, I've opened up, open up a few shops and, well, I am actually selling some, some crap around here. So, uh, yeah, I guess. Uh... I need more of those yarn balls. Yeah, so that thing for that thing I guess we have to get ourselves some more uh some more production chains. Probably. I don't know. We'll see. For now this thing is progressing as intended, I guess. Uh outside of the fact that this is not going according to why is this thing stocked? Yo! You're not stop you're not supposed to be stocked that much. Hmm. Okay, that's a bit problematic. Right, so we got a basic income over here. I've uh, removed some of the stuff, you know, I moved them around and stuff like that. So uh, I've added more yarn ball maker for my little cats. <laughs> Yay! Pile of metal debris. Can I... Oh, I can remove that some. Okay, so I need a loom. Okay, research. Research in progress. The abandon is working, as intended. Right, also I need to get myself research complete. That was quick. Uh... Listen here, I need to... I don't know what the optic cables are for. Connects stuff to labs, data storage and other high-tech buildings. Research complete. I can actually make those things? Oh, I can. Sure, let's let's craft some of those. Uh, smart cat store. Cat store. Lumber mill. Oh, I need a lumber mill. Uh, how, how did I develop this thing? I don't know. I should probably know, but I don't. I cannot press anything over here. I'm guessing, you know, it relaxes stuff like that. Build loom somewhere around cotton collector. Loom. Okay. Sure game. Why not? Uh, loom. I got the resources, which is interesting. I have never expected I'm gonna have enough resources for that thing. But first things first, I need to collect connect the, the store with the cable. Because, yeah, machine learning and stuff like that. Yay, we are analyzing data. Okay, right, I'm I'm guessing because the screen turned to purple that I'm currently analyzing data from the from the stores. Autosave complete. Yay! Loom. How the heck this thing works? I need to build a thing next to a cotton collector, but what exactly Oh Okay You're allowed to Elite Engineer program simply share a 10 minute or longer recording of the gameplay to immobilize <laughs> I can be immobilized Im immortalized image shut up I'm gonna worry about that thing later on. Oh. Ah, cloth. Okay. So this loom can get me some clothing. Okay. Right. So clothing is basically an extra resource for the cats. Okay. Hmm. I don't need that much of it, but I need some of it. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna get ourselves a cotton collector. Uh, yeah, I know what you're thinking. No, we're not gonna do that thing. Hmm. Let's see. I could build this thing here, like such. Okay, just get out of the building section. Hey, hello! Thank you. Okay, and then I can try to create a loom. Can I build it next to each other? Yeah, I can! Have some! Okay! And now, we just have to connect the, uh, the belt to the other thing, so let me see. I'm gonna need a lot of belts. Lots and lots of belts. And for that thing, we need metal. Guess what? I ran out of metal because we have to do everything manually. Yay! That's why I wanted to generate myself, research myself on mine. So I would not have to do this thing manually. Guess what? The game have a different idea for me, apparently. Okay, I need a lot of belts. Give me shitloads of belts, game. Shitloads of belts. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
Come on, I know you have it. I know you have it with you. Okay, and then this thing will go like this. Beautiful. We now got clothing for the cats. <laughs> nice. How much? Hmm. Crafting. Okay, uh, if this thing will get overloaded, then we'll have to probably add some more loops. We'll see about that thing in the future. Uh, for now, leave it as it is. See how that thing is gonna work. And now, cloth is getting delivered to my stores. Which means that the cats now can buy that thing. I don't know how the cats are acquiring money, man. It's a never-ending mystery, and I don't want to go into it. I'm actually starting to think that one of those cotton collectors is not enough for one loom. See? He takes a pause to... To produce anything. Hmm. That's a bit tricky. But okay, we'll see how that thing is gonna go. And we should look at that. Other things have unlocked. Extracts metal from iron veins. That's nice. Clav sharper. This is clav sharper for a tough life in cat community. <laughs> Rumble mills. Chops trees and slices them into pieces of wood. Box makers. Creates wonderful cardboard. Cardboard boxes. Yeah, this is the thing. If you want to catch a cat, okay, you don't need to set up like a, like a, I don't know, some heavy thinking, you know, brainstorming trap. No, 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 no. Just put an empty box, okay, and you're gonna have a cat in moments. Uh, cat gate, okay. Brings all kinds of cats to the factory. No one knows where they come from. <laughs> yeah, fish maker. Breeds happy fish in a water tank. Cat food maker. Cat house maker. Wait, cat house maker? What? Storage? Lo long manipulator? For moving objects and cats that happen to be kind of out of reach. Manipulator. Grabs items from transports and buildings and gently moves them around. Its touch is so gentle it can't even move cats. And they totally don't mind. Let's have some. Cat sorter. Oh! Separates cats line by cat types for higher quality service. Triple splitter. Quad splitter. Turning T. Con Converse game of life. What? No idea. I have some statue. Uh, regression. Liner. I don't even know that I have materials to get all of those industry around here. So I got myself a new industry thingy. Ooh, there's a lot of trees over there. How nice. I think I can make a lumber out over there. Uh, yeah, I cannot destroy a lot of trees around the island, so I'm kind of running out of trees. Yay! Points for bonus planet. Yo, yeah, I know. I fucked up so badly. But anyway, uh, I think the cotton fields are still increasing, which is kind of terrifying. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to think about that. So, yeah, I think we're going to make the craft sharpener over here. So, I got myself. I got myself the... What is that shit? There it is. The drill. I need more metal for that thing. I need more metal to... Gather metal. Sure, by all means, man. Like, let's see how this thing is gonna go. So, thankfully, this thing is unlimited. See, Factorio, some guys can add unlimited resource deposits. Okay, so I got that thing, and I need now the clav sharpener. So, for that thing, we need to get the research done. How I do this? How I do this? Hello, I want to research you. Hello, game. What the fuck? What, I need this thing? Don't tell me that I need both lumber and and metal for this shit. <laughs> Don't even try to tell me this. The man for a new type of uh, kind of an item detected. Let me guess, you want the club sharpener now. Okay, now uh, box some type of a box. See, I think that's the that's the club sharpener. So how why uh, cotton collector drill? No 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 lumber mill no. Where is that shit? How do I build that shit? Hello, game? Uh... Yo! How do I... Wait, what? Oh, okay. Uh, so, I got the lumber mill, and now we can research this thing. Aha! So, the new research, the new item is the lumber mill. Okay, can create one. Just have to go back to creating lumber mill. How does it even work? Like this? What, you're gonna generate trees out of, like, thin air? Because, you know, the trees actually don't grow! <laughs> I've noticed it the hard way! What the heck is this thing doing? Hey, hello? I don't see any trees! 
Wow. This is gonna take a while. Well, shit. Oh, how nice. The game is actually worthy about to stay hydrated. Step away from the game and drink some water. Are you actually drinking barsht? <laughs> so that's nice. Uh, hmm. Okay, well, this thing is making wood technically for me. So sure, let's 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 just roll with it. The drill. Ah, I have to build it on this. Oh. You've took away my my deposit. That's kinda terrifying. Also, you'd like a gigantic space tit. Finally I got myself the clav sharpener. Okay, how does this thing work, huh? Oh. We need cotton, metal, and wood. Okay, that's gonna be a Bit problematic. <laughs> so I got a lot of uh, cotton over here, and I think I'm gonna use that thing, you know? Yeah, that that should be probably a great idea. Or it's gonna backfire at me terribly. Out of that thing is fine. So, yeah, be smart and how exactly I'm gonna connect all of this thing, huh? If I'm gonna split it like this, it's gonna be one, two. It's not gonna work. La di da. Hmm. How we could try to do this thing actually? Okay, how's like first first of all I have to destroy those bells because they are really bloody annoying. Connect those things. Okay. So this thing goes out and goes into four, right? So I would have to make four. So one will go over here, let's say. One will go over here. Alright, so that's four belts. It's kinda hard to split four into five. I have honestly no idea what this thing work. We'll see, we'll see. So split it over here, split it over here. Okay, so how? if you wonder how this thing is actually gonna uh, work, allow me to show you. Mm. Come on, game, there you go. Okay, so I got two conveyor belts coming from the opposite side with, with, with uh, cotton, right? So they go around and split into uh, those two, then those two split into four, right? So it's uh, this one. This one goes on a single belt over here. It goes into this, splits into two, and then those two goes into one more splitter, right? So in total we got one, two, three, four, four splitters on this side. Now, three belts, three outputs connect together and go one once again to another splitter, and then this splitter will split to this factory over here, and this one will split to this factory over here, right? Same goes on the opposite side. Like such, okay? And now we are stuck with those two. So those two will connect, hopefully, and they're gonna go to create the sharpeners for the uh, for the cats. I know, it's brilliant. Almost. Why oh, cannot connect you? C collect you. Hello. Thank you. Thank you, game. Thank. Thanks. Much appreciated. All right. We just need to get some more belts, and that should be enough. Okay. Sharpener. I have no idea is this actually a good idea or not. <laughs> We're gonna find out very soon, boys. We're gonna find out very soon. Uh, right, so you're gonna go down here. And connect to this. You go up here. Maybe not like that, thank you game. And then you, of course, will join the party. Not like this. Not like that. My controls are all over the place. And... Connect. Yay! Okay, that's a bit... Much, a lot, holy shit, oh, I was not expecting to have this many, what the hell is going on over here? Ah, Christ, don't tell me, yeah. This shop got blocked. <laughs> oh, not funny. Not funny at all, game, not funny. Seriously, not funny. And I got myself a new uh, store for, for, for my cats. Hmm, what is it? Okay, I need, to... guess what, I need resources. Who'd have expected that thing to happen, right? Hmm, I'm actually thinking about getting myself a lumber yard over here and on those apple trees, you know? Like, can I collect those things? I hope? Was the... Club shy? No, lumber mill. I need metal. An age of metal. Yeah, sure, I mean, like, what's, what's that could possibly happen, right? What the heck is... Oh, it's the box maker. Yeah, I've researched this thing. Yeah, you just need trees. Okay. Sure, and the next thing in the research is something related to apples. If I, yeah, apple collector. Picks apples from apple trees. Requires boxes to pack apples for sale. Uh, 
that could be a bit of a difficulty because I got a lot of apples, but I barely got any tree. Okay, we got some trees over there. Maybe it could actually work? And I got myself uh, some cat stores, so let's replace those. Wait, uh, that's also me. Yeah, I have to take all of my resources with me. Uh, guys, can I take those resources, please? Okay, that's not gonna work. Okay, cut off the uh, delivery belts. Use all of the resources inside. <laughs> At least the majority of the ones, please. So that we can, you know, not lose money. Apparently, I cannot replace the already existing, existing ones, which is kind of annoying. Come on, game! You can do it! Oh, it's so cute! Why there's not an option to pet the cats, huh? Dev, where is the option to pet the fucking cats? Where is the option, man? Where is it? Oh, also, uh, I'm making boxes over here. Yeah, so basically, uh, like, I don't know. Ecology, friendly, traps for cats. Also, is this like in German? Why did... Yeah, it, I think it's, it's German, because it's like what, die cats? Die cats, maybe. I don't know. I think it's in German. Hard to say. Uh, right, did you manage to... S yeah, you sell the majority of the items. I don't think I recover... Okay, 42. Do I recover the items from the store as well, if I'm gonna do this? Yeah, I do! Oh, okay. Right, so... Not this. Pet shop uh, thingy. Right, one over here, one over here. Okay. Now it can work, bad boys. And connect those things as well. Nice. Select your price. Uh, yes, I guess. I don't know. And with a bit of my research, I finally got myself the smart stores. Wow, this thing is big. Holy shit. Okay, I need one more, please, game. Thank you. Uh, so we're gonna get that thing done. And what else do I need? I need probably another box maker, you know. So let's get that thing done. And with all of those. I do believe that we got the majority of the things done. Like, the rest of it, this thing is basically like advanced stuff, you know, but it's rise and repeat uh, the same thing. So, providing the cats with more resources, such as like cat houses, pillows, ropes. I don't know, can I actually supply the cats with ropes? Uh, but I think I have to use actually the cat sorter somehow. Separates cat line by cat types for higher quality service. Yes, yeah, so some cats require, for example, for them to sell scrap metal and stuff like that, but the other ones need, like, let's say, boxes, uh, they need cloth, they need, like, you know, the advanced stuff, so, uh, depending on the cat, you get different, different needs, different uh, requests. Smart cat store, probably smarter than you. This type of uh, stores can be empowered with machine learning mod models that can, that are capable of analyzing sales data and setting optimal prices using math magic. Yeah, it's always magic when it comes to math. Okay, so got those things done. Yay! Out of stock. <laughs> that was quick. Set your prices. Open seller reports. Pillows. Okay, why are there only four of items displayed here? Empty slot. So what? It depends on... It depends on the... On the requirements of the shop? What you buy here? Or depends on what I'm gonna just... Apparently a shop can sell only four items at a time. So that's why you need a cut, sh cut short sorter. That is English, hard English, hard, hard, very hard. Research complete. So that means now where uh, I should have yeah the cat sorter. So this thing should sort cats and their needs, and by that it should be easier for me to sell. St oh my God, this thing looks like a splitter. <laughs> okay, whoa, ah, ah. So that depends on the cats. They got all different needs. Like this is, it's not like they just look differently. They actually have different needs. So, for example, set your prices. Right, see this cat, he he won't buy any of those. Uh, the normal cat is a panty bike, everything, I guess. So, normal cats, right. Okay, uh, set your prices. Also, those are the items I'm actually selling in here. So, for example, the <laughs> Hellbender cat is not buying any of those items. Right, I'm not selling anything that he's actually buying here. Hmm. Okay, so for example, wholesome cat and cat. Yeah, I think I can roll with this. Is there like an information on cats, 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 item, cats, there you go. Aha, there it is. Okay, so based on this thing, see for example, worker cat. This guy requires those items, right? Mm, then you got this one, he buys all of those expensive items. Then you have this one which buys those items. 
Uh, okay, does any of you... Right, he buys uh, the uh, Scratcher and Box of Fruits. Box of Fruits. Scratcher. Okay, so it's gonna be a lot harder than I have expected. So each cat requires different resources to buy. la di bloody da Okay, la di bloody da Right, so that, that's basically one way to, to sort this thing out. So instead of using those, uh, I can, let's say, I'm gonna split the cats here, right? So the normal cats will go that way. And the rest of them will go the other way. See? Wait, what? Uh... Okay? Oh! Oh, that's how it works. All right. So, look at that. I've made two cat splitters, right? Because apparently those two share common uh, requests. <laughs> the ones that I cannot meet the requests go to this side shop over there because they won't get anything from me. And yeah, this this is progressing. Well, more or less it's progressing, actually, you know, because I'm still, like, missing a few items. I don't know why the cat store has only four items when, for example, the basic cat, the most common cat, actually requires sometimes five different items. So I'm guessing this is like a real development issue. Hard to say, boys. Hard to say. But anyway, if you want to give the game a try, it's gonna be a link in the description below, as always, but please remember that this is still uh, early access. It's like super early access. Like, if you're gonna go to the research tree, right? I am focusing for the entirety of this episode on this tree, right? This is the full tree. So yeah, there's, there's like a few things over here. Super, uh, superior critic, cat, cat artificial intelligence. Ultimate AI model. Can I calculate the goal of cat's existence, along with the answer to the questions of life, universe, and everything. Will be built. Someday. <laughs> yeah, someday, that's for sure. So yeah, anyway, uh, I hope that this gives you guys a good idea of what this game is about. It's a chilling game, you know, it's like, unlike Factorio, you don't really have to bother about worrying that resources will run out, or that you have to fight with biters, or that, I don't know, you're gonna screw up something and you're gonna run out of resources because stuff. It's like super, super chilly, super calming Factorio game. So if you are that type of a person that Factorio basically pisses off because it's, it's, it's maybe not hard, but it's unusual game. And the developers of Factorio, they, they, knew, they knew what they're doing, okay? Uh, this is basically a simple, simple, simpler version of Factorio and that's completely fine. I mean, nobody wants to... Uh, nobody. Not everybody wants to fight with biters all day. Not everybody wants to worry about ammunition, electricity, and God knows what else, right? Some of us just wants to go around, make boxes, and let cats play with those boxes. And that'll be completely fine as well. So yeah, if you want to give the game a try, uh, link's description below uh, as well. And, well, I'm guessing I will return to the game once it's gonna get some more updates, and we'll see... How that thing is gonna go. But that's gonna be the thing, ladies man. I'm gonna leave for the future. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like, if you subscribe, it helps a lot. I'll see you in the next video.